understand that this is something that we can do. We can strive and thrive in this. Well, with the Commonwealth Games, I really was trying to, you know, see where I was going next year. I didn't know. You know, really think about world championships and tell them much more closer. At the beginning of the season, I had, you know, a small effect that it really threw me off my race, but, you know, to be improving week after week, race after race, and, you know, my small stint in Europe where I won, you know, three races, a world challenge, back to back to back, you know, it really put me on on pace, you know, to do something about the world champs. When did you realize that it was really the I think. <laughs> I would have to say during the warm up on the bus right here. You know, I'm telling myself, you know, this is any man's race. Anything is possible. You've been doing well. You're just as fast as these guys. And, you know, anything is good. You know, I think early on in the season where I would say at the Pan Am Champs, where I was able to win, you know, against people who I thought were undefeatable and, you know, number one, you know, sometimes they started to crumble apart and lose, you know, their form and everything. And I would still be strong. So, that kind of showed me that anything is possible and I'm able to come back and win. Having said anything is possible, at the end of the day, no. Do you think that if you had done something a little bit different, it may be a little higher than the middle of the form? Yes. I think if I didn't run as ecstatic and kept my form, I might have run a little fast. I'd love to get some feedback from my coach, but you know, I'm still happy. I understand that I need to get a little bit more mentally tough and a short of myself, but I'm going to try and do that for next year. You know, on the races that come, I'm going to try and be a better athlete, a strong athlete. My final question, will we see you on the 4x4 for Bahamas, which Bahamas a very good chance No, you will not. You will not see me. They have, you know, a good example of guys, and I felt that, you know, after my stint in Toronto, 400 meter hurt speed is not the same as open 400 meter speed. You know, you saw today with the semis or yesterday with the semis that you know, those guys were rolling. Their open times would be my splits. So, you know, you have to understand that I will let them do their job and I will do my job. Thank you. Thank you. Jeffrey, I've got one almost run the 48 and the 400. Oh, yes, no doubt. I have, you know, confidence in the athletes that they will perform to their well, be their best. And I know that this 4 by 4 is going to be hard. I have full faith in my boys that I know that they'll be able to do well. So, you know, I'm just going to be there supporting them and encouraging them. What do you think Shawnee Miller can do in the 400? I think that she can win this. Shawnee is a strong girl. You know, she has God and everyone on her side. So, you know, anything is possible. I look forward to that race and all the best for her. Do you think we can see the first 48 race in a very long time? Um, I think so. If both of them are hot up and you know, fiery about, you know, beating the other and, you know, dropping a crazy amazing time, then I think, you know, a 48 could come. Um, they've been running 49, mid-49 low, but, you know, I look forward to seeing that and seeing what the race has for them. When you say both of them, you mean Shawnee Miller and maybe Allison Felix? Yes, uh, Shawnee Miller and Allison Felix, Allison Felix, but, you know, not to count out people like Christine or who wrote, you know, she's the world champ. 